Hey, my name's Nick McGuire. People call me Mr. Deansgate and I work at Deansgate Media Group. So Deansgate Media Group creates digital stories, brings them to life through video and video marketing. I guess what makes us different is that we want to bring creative ideas that are specifically around how video and video marketing will work. So everything we think about, all our ideas come down to the video story and more importantly, how that can be measured and deliver results online. So it's for beginning to the end of video marketing. You know what, we've had a load of really great customer wins, but some of the stuff we've done that's delivered massive results, I suppose, is, is where the highlights are. So, you know, when the spa at the Midland Hotel opened their brand new spa, they approached us because they had a TV series going on and they wanted to, even though it wasn't included in the TV series, raise awareness of the beautiful spa they've got down there. So we created a short internet marketing campaign around video using the spa, but what was really exciting is because of the way we implemented it, we were able to show that we doubled the number of views on their Facebook page on the spa more than they did on the Midland, even though that had TV coverage. So for me, being able to show that an internet marketing campaign can deliver more online results than actual TV was a phenomenal success for us. I really couldn't think of a better city to start a new business in. It's, it's vibrant, it's growing, we've got transport links. All right, the roads are a bit dead right now, but that's because we're fixing them. So we've got, you know, the airport is expanding. We've got HS2 coming into Manchester. You've got such a, a, a huddle of people from, from all different areas that are coming and bringing talent. We've got different quarters that specialise in different areas from, you know, the legal sector to the creative sector to a media city where we've got such a great pool of talent. Our universities, our colleges, even small colleges like FutureWorks, uh, rolling out people that are specialists in, uh, in video and editing and production. So we've got all these specialist skills coming together. Great food, great drink, great transport links, great people. What's not to love? Wow, when you talk about influential people in Manchester, that's, that's a, a tricky one. I've got to say, personally from me, I, I'd have to look at uh, Tim and Jeremy that head up uh, Living Ventures. These guys have just re redefined what it means to do hospitality. Both of them, in their own way, are just phenomenal guys and you know, people I look up to um, uh, from, from a business perspective. They're, they're amazing guys. But there are so many other people. Chris Marsh, what he's doing down at, at UK Fast, you know, one of the nicest guys you'll ever meet. Connecting people, building uh, people together, really good. But but even, even some of the more controversial figures are great. You know, Gordo over at Manchester Confidential, what he's been doing, you know, over uh, over years, probably decades, uh, has been great about, you know, get, getting uh, data capture and pushing out and promoting Manchester. So I think there's a lot of people that are very influential. Um, really, when you're in Manchester, well, probably the most exciting thing is everybody's influential, lots of people are connected, so it's not just one or two superstars, really it's getting to know people, understand what they're all about, and everybody kind of helps each other, it's the culture. I think for me, when it comes to who I'd recommend, I have to do it by people I've worked with. I've got to say, without a shadow of doubt, what Paul Barnes is doing with the guys down at my accountancy place are, are phenomenal. You know, accountants pretty boring anyway, but these guys, spot on, they're doing more than just doing your numbers and your books. They're connecting people. They've got really high-end software that's connecting people together, so you're efficient when it comes to your accountancy practice. They're all over it, so for me, my accountancy place would be probably the first business I think of from a B2B perspective uh, to recommend in Manchester. Well, for me, you know, people call me Mr. Deansgate because I live on Deansgate. What's beneficial about working in Manchester? Everything's a walk away. So literally everything I need from uh, business services, B2B services, platform speaking, um, whatever it might be, digital um, specialists, everything is within one or two blocks. So for me, the geography of the city centre makes it work. We're all working, living, um, socialising together. So what makes Manchester so vibrant is the fact that it is an international city, but it's small enough still to be a village so it's a great place to do work and it's a great place to live you know what Manchester is a great place for startup companies I mean when you look at things like the business growth hub for instance where you can get up to 25,000 pounds as a startup with government money and advisors that will assist you there are small businesses like I've mentioned my accountancy place that can provide you with the services that you can outsource that will help you grow but again I've got to say this what makes Manchester different is the fact that this is fast growing but we're still like a village and a community people get on with each other people try and help each other the reason why you should put your startup business in Manchester is because you will get the support of the Manchester community. I mean, I've just had meetings today with competitive um, accounts, but they are helping me out because we sort of help each other out. I guess it's like Tony Wilson said, we just do things differently in Manchester. 
so I've just been asked what my favorite place to eat and drink is in the city. It's probably everywhere. Um, there are so many. I mean, Albert Schloss just opened up. And it's a great place to drink because it's not my next door bar now. Um, I love going down to Neighborhood. That's a great place to go for perhaps Sunday lunch or a party in the evening. Um, any of the Living Ventures restaurant is great. Everyone talks about Manchester House or, or Australasia. If you've got loads of cash and you want to do it properly, go to the French or even Mr. Cooper's. Fabulous places to go. Beef and Pudding, the guys over there from New Moon, they've got you know an urban pub right in the center of town and I'm pretty much when you go into any of the northern quarters that's great I was recently a judge at the Italian Awards and I was asked to judge best pizzeria slice over on the northern quarter St. Stevenson Square what a place to go for amazing little bits of pizza so I'd recommend that too so the reality is you can pretty much go anywhere but for me they do call me Mr. Deansgate, there's a reason. I like to just party up and down Deansgate, and I do include Spinning Fields and St. Peter's Square and um, uh, St. Anne's Square, and actually any other square off Deansgate is included. So for me, you know, I've been around for a while. I've worked in large corporates and different startups. When I started Deansgate Media Group, I wanted to be the center and the heart of my own business. And I wanted to be able to connect businesses with what's happening in Manchester and what's happening on social media and the internet. So I guess what I'm really passionate about right now is how video is igniting social media. How a few years ago, we would look at Facebook and there would be nothing but text. And now it's the videos we stop for. And what I'm passionate about is trying to get video stories into businesses that they can use in social media media to get more traction. It gives us competitive advantage, it gets us more eyeballs, more viewership, and it, and it engages people with our messages and our stories. So I'm really passionate about being able to work with businesses, consult with businesses, talk about how video can extend their content strategy and be the heart of their content strategy, and then help them deliver it with some measurable ROI. So for me, I, you know, I started by creating video blogs uh, on my own YouTube channel, and they gave me incredible sort of uh, sway and success in the city. And I'm thinking, if I can do that just for me why can't we do that properly for businesses and see how we can help promote them using video online so I guess if any if my passion was anything it's about telling these digital stories in social media terms now so what, what really makes me excited about what we're doing with the business is we're trying to understand what businesses are doing and then we're trying to get that to happen for them on social media with the end in mind. So we just work with an amazing brand which has just come to Manchester and we've taken a TV concept and we're applying that for an internet marketing campaign on video. You're gonna see it coming soon and you will know what I'm talking about when you see it, but we are so excited to be able to take what used to cost a fortune in TV terms turn that into something that can happen on video marketing and deliver and see results instantly. So that's what we're doing at Deansgate Media Group. It's exciting, it's passion, and it's all around video. Hey, thanks for watching. I'm Nick McGuire from Deansgate Media Group, and I've been huddled.